All right, so I have a story of a family who is fighting to keep a photo of their daughter giving the finger on her gravestone. That's tight. <laughs> and... <laughs> that is cool. Yeah, so this She's is... like going like this, and then... Oh. Is, oh. Does, does she do it like this, or is she a this one? So this is or what she, the gravestone looks like. like. So she was, she was 13 years old when she died of cystri cystic fibrosis. Oh. And this is the picture. <laughs> so she's kind of like going like this. That's tight. She's just and, a badass. Yeah, and so. Oh, I got the bottom line. Hmm? Rip babe. <laughs> Rip babe. Yeah. Rip babe. But yeah, so she died in February of this year. And so her gravestone has been there for several months. What cystic fibrosis? What kind of cancers is that? It's of the lungs. It's a yeah. disorder. It's not a cancer. And then they get like a um, fluid. You can see right? a, like yeah. fluid, oh, and then it's like a inherited life-threatening disorder. Oh, you born with it? Yes. Damn. So yeah, like. It's not Maybelline. Damn! No, it's not. <laughs> it's not. <laughs> She's born with it. What the? F <laughs> I mean, the more I thought about it, it became funnier in my head. Damn, <laughs> she's not. But yeah, so she ended up um, passing away from from that, and yeah. So anyway, the gravestone has been there for many months, and there have been no issues. But recently, the family got a phone call from the city council telling her that someone put in a complaint about oh the picture. My, who's this oh Karen oh ass oh bitch? Yes. Or oh what's so the male good. Karen, Peter? The picture's not even big. You have to like look close to like even notice it. Right. It's, it's not like a giant man. statue. No. <laughs> yeah. giving the it, looks like as it looks like you're bitch. Just picking her nose too, if anything. Ew. But what if it's the neighbor like right next to it? Aren't they blank tombstones? The ones, the next yeah, the one's like tower oh, over her. Can't yeah. see it. They look Maybe like blank decide. ones. What's with all these places that get complaints and they they always follow up on it? But then, like, if I lose a package or something on the airline, right. they're like, fuck you, we don't give a shit! Yeah. Go fuck yourself! That's what happened to your, to your luggage. <laughs> Until you get on Twitter and use your social media powers to get some service, yeah, and then they treat you like a king. That's your only hope. Yeah. That's the only reason why I wanted to be famous, mm -hmm. is so, like, companies will actually talk to me. There you go. You rat the fuck out of them. <clears throat> yeah. So, anyway, so yeah, someone complained about this picture, and so the they told her, like, the mom, they told her that they are willing to swap the picture free of charge, but the mom was like, no. I have no sympathy for the person that was offended. They don't have to look at it. I lost my 13-year-old daughter. I picked that picture for a reason. It represents her. If you don't like it, don't look at it. But True. now Hell they have yeah. to deal with, with this bullshit. Yeah. So it's just kind of like, are you fucking kidding me? Fuck anonymous complaints. Yeah. They need to fucking argue it out. Yeah, say it to my face then. Right. So Maybe this they should pull her picture and make it bigger, and then put that on top of the tombstone. <laughs> yeah, make That's it even cool. larger. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Make oh, a statue. Right. Make it huge. Make a statue of her Yeah, double, make double a statue bird. like yeah. this. Make it bigger than these guys. Yeah. Yo, do a GoFundMe. Let's do a GoFundMe to get a statue of her to replace that tombstone of I her going it. like this. Yeah, I love it. <laughs> I love it. Dude, let's do. Let's go even do further. It. Let's rename the graveyard whatever the fuck it is to fuck you, motherfucker <laughs> graveyard. <laughs> fuck you, cemetery. <laughs> yeah, fuck you cemetery. The, instead of Rose Hills, it's fuck you cemetery. Yeah. Yeah. Hell yeah. Damn. Yeah. <laughs> They're gonna get no business. Yeah, like, oh. Where's your grandma buried? Fuck you! Oh, I'm sorry. No, 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 she's at fuck you! <laughs> I can't believe people who already have to deal with such crazy shit, like somebody having cystic fibrosis, dying very young. Now they gotta yeah. deal with this bullshit. They right. wanna remember, remember her for something, you know, funny, right? It's probably someone who has someone in that graveyard, you know, and I'm I'm assuming it's one of the neighbors. I am I'm assuming because you gotta it, like I saw little crosses or whatever next to the next to her, right? So it's mm -hmm. as soon as I'm, I'm assuming that it's someone that put like something down on the ground, looked up and said, "What the fuck, this girl's doing this." Mm -hmm. So just a little hint for you, it's probably one of those bitches. I'm writing them out. Yep. yep. And I'll just hit them up. I'll be like, "Yo, is this the whatever family? Mm -hmm. You got some shit? Say to my face, bitch." They're like. Yeah. They're like, no, and you're like, oh, sorry to bother you. Let me call someone else. <laughs> They're like, what? <laughs> no, he just goes through the entire cemetery yeah. calling all the families. Say to my face, bitch. Bitch. Yeah. Well, you, can't, you can't be against the rules, right? There's no rules that say, like, 
I know, right? You can't. I, I mean, they approved it, it in the beginning. It's yeah. the smallest little picture I've ever seen in my whole life. Yeah. And yeah. you're paying for it, so I don't know why the other person is being so It's not like you painted your house pink, yeah. and I'm your neighbor. And what didn't they say this means different things in different languages, too? Really? So it's like, yeah. What does it mean? I don't know, it's just what I heard, I heard. I think it means fuck you and fuck you! <laughs> yeah, different versions of it. I mean, it's one of those things where like people don't want to explain shit to their kids. So they're like, when we're visiting grandma at the grave, I don't want to explain to my five-year-old what the middle finger means. And be like, I'll be like, I would. <laughs> they say Tell that, me when you're going next time, I'll explain it to her. They say that, but then I see kid, uh, parents at the grocery store or like at Target, and their kid like has something and they're holding it, right? And then they get to the checkout and their parents like, oh, look at that. And then they take it out of their hand and it just disappears. And then it's gone and the kid doesn't even know what the fuck's going on. <laughs> they, they know how to trick their kid like that, but they don't they don't want to have to explain something. Like it's the stupidest yeah. shit. Fuck you means making a baby, but in a bad way. <laughs> what? Yeah, that's right. I don't know if I would define it like that. <laughs> yeah, what is, why do we say fuck you like that? Because when you think about it, it's, it's like, like sex you. Yeah, it's, yeah, that's yeah. weird, right? True. I know, it's it's like, look at the origins. Hey, I want to have sex with you. Hmm. You're, you're, you're trying to just I wish German, wish ill you. upon someone. Yeah, but then you're saying fuck you. It's like, oh, thank yeah. you. Wow, I, I hope I get some. Yeah. <laughs> it's one of the best words in the English language. Feels yeah. so good. Yeah, if you're bilingual or um, if you if you if you're Germanic uh, origin. Yeah. It's been around for a while. I researched the history of it. It's related to Dutch, German, and Swedish. What do they say? For, but they're such a for nice group to of strike Fook. and to move Fook. back and forth. Like fucking. The Irish say fuk. How Conor McGregor. That's how I do it. <laughs> Who the fuk is that guy? <laughs> you fucking loser. <laughs> oh, it's like if someone calls you a pussy, you know? That's How's that offensive? Thing. I'm like, damn, I'm wet. Yeah, yeah. dude. I'm and just... powerful. I'm something. I, I'm something I've been chasing my whole life. <laughs> And could take a beating? Damn. Oh, take, can yeah. take the deepest beatings. Yeah. Maybe that's why you're a pussy, because you're always taking beatings. <laughs> that's pretty good. <laughs> I tried Googling what the middle finger means for other places. Well, I Googled, um, what did I Google? I put, does the middle finger mean, and then you know how to like, oh, it finishes it? Oh, It said, the mean <laughs> that you hate God, or that you're, go to, you're going to hell. I thought those, both, I, I just pictured like a four year old, like, or five year old. Googling this shit. What does this mean? Mm. Yeah. Mommy won't tell me Google will. <laughs> yeah. But anyway, it says that the finger does not have any meaning at all in some parts of the country. That's this it. country? A US? Not the US. Uh, uh, it's like a walk uh, in Oklahoma. Some parts. And Germany? I used to get my grandma to take the world. pictures okay. with me parts like this. World. I had my grandma take pictures with me like this. I fucking love these fingers. Yeah, I'll be like, like, do this, grandma. This and is then, like, like every we take pictures like this. 16 year old girl's birthday party photo. That's yeah. true. Fuck off! Yeah. Yeah. College parties. Yeah. <laughs> Woo! I can Shot drink now, yeah. bitch! I'm bad! <laughs> oh, it says, although the finger has been called the universal sign of disrespect, it is not truly universal. For example, in Japanese well, sign yeah, language, when the palm is facing out, it is recognized as the character se. Many other gestures are used oh, in so addition. Oh, so walk through Japan. Se. se. My se. grandma used to point with her middle finger. Like she, she'll she'll point at stuff on the book with her middle finger. A lot of people do that. My grandpa too. Yeah. yeah. Oh yeah, in Russia, the middle like finger the is finger. the middle finger used to simply point. That is how I press yeah. buttons. I use yeah. One of my favorite traditional photos is just a dude, a dude with a beer, and you've all seen this picture. It's like, yeah, guy with a chug of beer, flipping off the camera. But that's that's fucking, true. That's some cultural shit right that there. That is, huh? It's kind of like the peace sign. <laughs> yeah, dude. It's like oh, peace. Oh, crazy. Did you know there was a V sign? In the Commonwealth of Nations countries, except Canada, the V sign is an insult. The middle and index fingers raised and given with the back of the hand towards the recipient serves like a similar purpose to the middle finger. Index. The V sign with palm face outwards instead of in is a sign of peace. <laughs> So this is bad. This is, this is good. And this is peace. Wow. This feels Canada. better though, because this feels like my finger's way more yeah. erect. <laughs> like yeah, fuck well, it's you. So far. It's like Your other motion. finger's so far back. Yeah. It's like exposed. It's like what? naked. Yeah. Fuck you. <laughs> you know the piece, the cheese piece. Yeah. It's supposed like the cheese, like that. Like this is a victory sign. V. Peace out, dude. My my right middle finger isn't as flexible as my left one. You know this one is another one. This one's erect like crazy. This one's not that erect. Hey, I got a picture with my grandma. This is another one. 
Yes, that, that one. one fuck you. What is that? Who knows you? Says, the sign of the horns or cornice, Italian horned hand, is a gesture with various meanings depending on yeah. culture, context, or the placement or movement of the gesture. <laughs> it is especially common in Italy and the Med Mediterranean region, I've where it generally it. takes on two different meanings depending on context and positioning of the hand. First, it's, it's a amazing. very small dick. Uh, How about the fuck? Okay, yeah. that's what it means. Oh, they do it like this. That was really good. Thank you. Well, what does this mean? Oh, she has double that fuck That means you. fuck me tonight while I fuck you back. Oh, oh dang. Because <laughs> it is double middle finger. That right? means let's go okay. butt to butt and jerk each other off. <laughs> let's put that behind our butt cheeks and stick it into our asses. Yeah, yeah see? <laughs> oh, in Greece, five fingers are spread wide and the palm is pushed towards someone in a, in, in a gesture known as a mutsa. The middle finger is still used though and is considered more insulting. Another variation of the middle finger is used where all the fingers but the middle one are separated wide. So let's just talk to the hand. So this one's did. offensive everywhere because if you push it to their face, yeah. it's like, hey! Talk to the fucking oh. hand, dude. You don't know if they're like trying to insult you or slap you in the face. Wikipedia is so interesting, guys. I love Wikipedia. You get to learn so many Such things. a good source of dependable knowledge. This is also called Iron Man. Yeah. <laughs> This also, talk to the hand, the face don't understand. Oh, right. Did you know in former Persia, mainly Iran and Iraq, a gesture involving exposing only the thumb in a vertical orientation, which is a thumbs up, is used instead of the finger to express roughly the same sentiment, roughly equivalent in meaning to shove it up your ass, or up yours, or go fuck yourself. Whoa, yeah. this is that? Yeah. Oh yeah, I've seen that where they go yeah. like that. Hey. Hey. I've never oh, put my you. middle finger up as an insult to somebody. You haven't? Oh, it's yeah, fun when you're driving. Yeah, yeah. I do it all the yeah, time when I'm right. driving. Do you not drive in Los Angeles, California? I'm a peaceful driver. Wow. I'm not. In some Arab countries, <laughs> this gesture bears negative, vulgar, or offensive meanings as well. The what okay, does it mean? It's not okay, okay gesture. Um, Isn't this watching too? It just means offensive. In contrast to Japan's use of the expression to represent coins and wealth, the gesture's O shape stands for zero meaning worth nothing in France, Belgium, and Tunisia. This is Walgreens shopper. You have to stand in a big fucking line. This is how you say no in, in Japanese. Really? Or you don't have it. Really? It's a big X. I think that's how you say no in every language. Yeah. Yeah. No English. Oh yeah, no. Yeah. No English. True. I like how in Japan you, you like you do this for like. How many? Yeah. How many two people. people yeah. Three people. Three people. Yeah. How do you do ten people? I don't know. This is how you say I'm not Catholic in a church. You do? When they like go up and bless you or whatever? Yeah. Yeah, you're just like. What does that mean? Really? You say like, hey, I'm. I'm, or, I'm don't put that holy water on me. Oh, you why like taking the communion or why? Yeah, like, yeah, when? That. Yeah, why? when they call you up to do that. But then like. Because everyone's coming up. So oh, they eat the little papers? Mm -hmm. why that just means you don't want to take it, right? Mm -hmm. It just means you don't want to take it. I'll take it. It's free food. I'm not Catholic. I take it every time. I want to take it too. The Welch's grape juice yep. and that little brick yep. is fucking good, dude. There's no alcohol in there. I don't drink alcohol in the first place. There used to be when Jesus Christ was walking around. Uh -huh. Well, anyway, I hope Kayla's family um, are able to keep the photo in the gravestone. That go fund me. I think. Yep. Yo, let's build a fuck you statue. Let's replace it with like a video billboard of her just like going. Yeah. Constantly. Photoshop. A GIF. A GIF. 